Good morning people of the peoples. I am a little tired guy and I have been up for about 45 minutes talking to my sister on the phone. Not for the whole 45 minutes, for a little bit. And that's why she's fallen asleep on there. I've given her treats on a bed. I talked to my sister about Disney Plus going up in price and today's the payment date. She's gone to bed. <laughs> um, am I feeling good? I feel good a little bit. I don't feel like I've got my full body battery. I don't even know the percentage of it. I haven't even checked. But I'm going to start today with a cup of tea and some chocolate hoops. Because that is the plan. Oh, I love it when the sun comes out in London. The sun's great. That's why I'm sitting here on my lovely chair. Um, yeah. What do I say? Oh, don't, don't wind it up. Starts on windy and it gets chilly. Um, let's see, yeah, we got got a few things to watch today, but we're gonna go out. We're gonna go out for a lovely walk. Probably, I don't know where we're gonna go. My next door neighbour's doing a bit of business in his garden. Oh, dogs are barking. Lovely. My dog's not barking, he wants to come out though. Look. Look at him. Let's go check, see if he wants to come out. Hello. 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 No, you don't sniff that. That's nasty. Oh. So before I came out here, I started watching the Misfits Boxing from last night. I started like a pre-show at eleven because obviously I was asleep. You know, when I tried to watch that film on Disney last night, you know I was tired. I tried for being. Like, it took me a while, it took me like about half an hour to get to sleep. I don't know why it took a while to get to sleep. But I managed to, and it was great. Good sleep. And then I wake up in the morning, um, obviously speak to my sister. And I've just watched, like, Misfits Boxing, I've watched the pre-show, and I watched the first fight, and then halfway through the second fight, it just went blank, and I was like, what the hell happened, like, everyone was evacuated out the, out the arena, and then I checked out what it was, and then they came back, obviously, and explained. So basically, online, everyone was saying that one of, well, someone made a bomb threat. And the whole arena got swatted, so they had to evacuate everyone. The police had to literally go through the whole arena and check everything out. And it took over an hour to actually come back, or an hour and a half, an hour and 20 minutes, something like that. And then people blame me on Aiden Ross's, one of Aiden Ross's guys, because he had a, he said he was going to have an event on the same day. Bloody stupid man. So I've still got to watch the next few fights. I think there's only three fights. You've got Taylor, Holder, you've got the other one, then you've got the main main fight. Best thing about not watching it live is that you get to skip the little bits that you just don't want to watch the next day. But then watching it live, like any boxing fight or even a football match, like in the moment, you're like, yes, yes, yes. Oh. Lovely weather. I could just lay out here all day. Should get the gym equipment just start working out. <laughs> That'll be good. Um, so yeah, we've taken care of one thing this morning. Uh, 
also found out collision went on last night because uh, they weren't they just didn't have a showing of it which means I didn't miss out on anything because they didn't show it which is good all I've got to do is watch yesterday, a uh, bit of yesterday's YouTube and then obviously my movie's TV show so what I'm going to do from now on every time we do the staying up for the whole day kind of thing every few days, not all the time but every few days all I'm going to do on, on like past 12 o'clock is like put the video together try and upload it if I can early in the morning like the video and then just basically watch movies watch my movies that are down here that I need to watch till mum and dad wake up and then stay down here but on the table with my laptop with the headphones in so they don't have to listen to it and just watch more movies for the whole day and then literally the more I keep doing that the less films it will get closer and closer to because we are in April uh, sorry we're in March but I mean next month's April and look I'm watching the halfway through June of last year Near enough a year. That's not good. I mean, it's a good thing that, like, the, the more movies I watch, the closer it gets. So that means I'll be able to watch the movies that are closer now. <laughs> well, hopefully, depending on what platform they're streaming on. Uh, yeah. Also, anyone that has a fire stick and does the RPTV uh, thing. Uh, yeah. It looks like anyone that has that is going to, uh, basically there's a new law saying that it tracks your IP address. So anyone that has that and has been found illegally streaming, uh, like events, boxing events, football events, something like that, any kind of event, that they're just, or like illegally streaming Netflix or Disney or, you know, any bad website that you can watch a movie on. A new law's been put in place, so people will get caught up. Ha ha ha. Pay it or go jail. Right. I understand if you can't pay it, you can't pay it. Uh, luckily with Sky, like, like, the movies that you can't watch, or, like, at a cinema, will be on Disney. Uh, not Disney. Will be on, like, Sky in the next, like, six months. <laughs> like, four to six months. I mean, they might not be out, like, straight away, obviously, it'll be, like, to rent it or own it properly, obviously, for a bit of money. But then normally it'd come out, guys, in a while, you could just watch it for free anyway. Or you just wait after a few months of it coming out on DVD, and it'll just go down in price, and you can just rent it, rent it from the library or something. You want this? Yeah, look at your time. So... Oh. At least we got one major thing sorted. And that's Disney Plus coming out tomorrow. Um, which is great. Then we won't have no problems. And everything will get better. We'll use the weights more. I'm eating good now, you know. I'm eating more meat and more veg. Hardly any potatoes, no potato products right now. Maybe some potato pops at some times, but I've stopped eating as much as that because I just wanna I just wanna eat more meat and veg and just try and see what it does for a while to my weight. To just try and lose weight. And then <laughs> last night <laughs> while I was um I was basically laying down uh, I was thinking about doing some shadow books and starting off. But then I was like, I'm trying to flip and go to bed. Why would I? <laughs> oh, no. Mummy, Mummy, Jojo. We're going to let her in. Oh, there we go. Oh, look. A little bit. Oh, go, go, come on. Here, miss. You scared her. Here, miss. 
Wait, Jojo, come on. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make another cup of tea. And I'm going to watch the boxing. I decided to come out and watch the boxing. Makes it a lot easier, seeing as the sun just went behind a cloud. So it's about to come out now. Screen full up. Yep, sun's out. Let's go. Oh. Sun keeps going behind a bloody cloud. It's really annoying. But I just finished watching the Misfits boxing whole 13 card. Alright, people that don't want to know the results. Get to the next thing. Uh, so Taylor Holder, or should we start from the actual start? Vitali beat Modine. That was a crap ass match. Not even lying to you, it was Shiza. Joey Knight versus Baby Hulk. Joey Knight won. I'm surprised Baby Hulk did not last longer than he did uh, at all. Uh, also, after the match, uh, Vitali's match, he got asked to do a drug test. And he said no. <laughs> he was literally on his live stream on kick and was like, I'm not doing a drugs test. What are they going to do? What are they going to do? He's like, I say no, no, end up, blah, blah, blah. So that's fun. And then obviously, little Cray Cray versus Yoddy Gang, two rounds in, and then the uh, bomb threat went off. So they had to, they done that as a no contest. Guys, could you stop scratching right there, please? Oh, look, Princess is coming. Come in. Yeah, you know. Let's get on, baby. All right. So, um, yeah, I was really interested in that little cray cray match. I can't believe some idiot called the police on them. Like on on the whole event, it's bloody stupid. And then after that, because it was a no contest, they didn't carry it on. It was Taylor Holder versus DWG Earth, Dog Earth, and Taylor Holder won. No surprise there, really. No surprise. Uh, and then we had we had Chris Avila versus Jake Boswick, and I I didn't really give a crap about this fight, but Avila won. Um, but I don't, I don't don't really know them, so I can't really give a give an opinion on like who was actually better in there and that. They just kept beating each other up. To be honest, it was like it was a draw, but whatever, you know. And then obviously Fox the G versus Most Wanted and Evil Hero. Turns out Most Wanted decided to not want to fight him. Sorry, Princess. Yeah, Most Wanted decided to not fight him. So one pulled out and Evil ooh, Evil Hero uh, basically continued. But Fox the G... Fox the G basically just fought Evil Hero and he won. <laughs> what wasn't really a surprise either there. Um although it did look like obviously the ending, like he punched him in the back of the head. You could clearly see it on the camera. Um but they still said it was a win. I mean I, I say it's a win as well. I and mean, then like I, I love the Fox's things after him. He was like, Why did you have to do him like that? Blah 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 at the end. And he was like, oh, I just had to, I had to remind him, like, he come in, he was shitting himself, I could smell it, like, <laughs> it was flipping hilarious. Um, so, yeah, and he still wants to face Most Wanted, but he wants to face, obviously, pretty much anyone else that he can. <sighs> Why are you on here? Come on. Numpty. She's been a little crap bag, isn't she, Mum? Yeah, it's been <laughs> So now that the sun's gone behind a massive cloud, I've got to put my phone on charge because it's only on 20%. So I'm going to go upstairs with the laptop and the charger. Well, my phone. So I can put my phone on charge, leave it on charge, and watch some stuff on YouTube till it is basically fully charged. Then I'm going to go get ready. Then we're going to go for a little walk. So right now, I can't even see my screen properly. <laughs> Let me just give it a wipe down. That's just a camera to at least know that you're all Gucci. So we are walking. We are out now. From now on, whenever the sun's great, even if the sun ain't that great, but like if, if it's not raining, you know, you know how I hate rain. Everyone hates rain. Like why, why? When it rains, you, you don't want to go out. 
know. Um, but when the sun comes out, I know that if I try and go out at least for maybe under an hour a day, just out in the sun for a little walk somewhere, whether it's down to the shops or down to the O2 or just along the river or anywhere else. Um, I'm going to basically, my hair's so fluff today, you know, I'm basically just going to go out. I'm going to try and get like near enough 45 minutes to an hour exercise outside, whether that's walking or not. And then I'm going to try and do, you know, for about 45 minutes exercise indoor each day. I'll try and do that. You know, I'm eating good. I literally just, you wake up, you have your cup of tea, you have your cereal, you brush your teeth. After that, you have a bit of water or an orange juice or something like that. You constantly have a bit of that. Well, this is for me anyway. And then for lunch, it could be like pasta or it could be a flapjack or it could be a couple of packets crisp. Ain't gonna be that bad high in calories, so that's gonna be good. Um, and then, yeah, I mean, if you want to have a little snack or something, that's up to you. I don't really have anything to snack on, which is great because there's calories in the belly. Um, and then, obviously, while you're doing whatever you're doing during the day, working, exercising, going to the gym or something, then, uh, you know, in the evening, dinner time. About 8 o'clock ish. Well, for anyone. There's a lot of people here. Um, and there's just normally a meal with a lot of veg. some a, a bit of meat and veg at least. And then you should all be good. And then if you fancy it, a bit of ice cream or be a cake or something. Like my food's good. Now it's just the exercise part. I've got to get out of the house more to stay away from the laptop and the computer. Just get the sun as well. Especially when the sun's out, you need to get as much as you can because you don't get that much in sunny days in England <laughs> in London especially so we're going to go to a lovely place where we can just basically lay down in the sun so let's go do you know I don't know why my hair is just so up literally it's wind like it don't it just wants to focus on this part and the back bit like I should have properly wet this morning and I didn't I just couldn't be bothered but we are out on the lovely area that I go to sometimes, just to chill out, all along here, all along here by the river. And look, the sun's out. All that keeps going behind the clouds, so I can't exactly like lay down, which kind of sucks. But we enjoy the sun while we can. Spoke to the sister and the sister's boyfriend, because the sister didn't want to pick up her phone, so I had to ring the sister's boyfriend to talk to her. Spoke to my niece, spoke to my brother, he's chilling. He's just playing GTA, blowing people up and stuff. Um, yeah, he don't want to go out and enjoy the sun because he's lazy. Why does the sun keep going behind? <laughs> Luckily the sun, apparently the sun's going to be out for the next like three hours. Two to three hours and then it's just going to go down. History in motion at Thames and Greenwich. Even the cable car ain't even working today, you know? Like, it was broken the other day, and it's broken again, although, that closer one right there, at the top, that, um, that has been moved since before I got here, it was on the other side. But now, It's moved. A bit weird. I thought we were going to stay out here for a bit in the sun. Hopefully, you know, where's that bloody cloud? Oh, look at that grey cloud. Look. Oh, man. That's where the sun is right now. And we've got to wait for it to pass for it to come back out again. Although, luckily, it's not cold. It's like, I mean, it's a little bit cold, but it's not too cold. So I'm just going to stay here out in the sun go back in about 20 minutes half hour then yeah it's not 
nothing else I can say. When the sun's hot, we go out. Look, the sun's, the sun's all the way over in Flipping Woolwich, but it's not over here because of the cloud. It's poking somewhere else. What the hell is the them slippers like? You're all turning around. But yeah, we're gonna relax. Well, you know what? We're gonna give my other sister a ring. So it's been like 15, 20 minutes since I was there. My other sister did not answer. Just love the river these days. <laughs> Beautiful. The only reason I'm walking back now is because of that massive cloud. I was just thinking the changed stuff. Well, the sun came out for like afterwards, an extra 15 minutes. And then it went behind a big cloud. So we do not like it. It's disgraceful. I have a feeling when I get back in, the sun's going to be out. And the thing is, the sun ain't even going to be pointed on my house. I mean, it will at the front, but not the back. Which kind of sucks. Unless I go in the courtyard and just lay there. I mean, I can. I haven't been out there since see, ages ago. But now it's feeling a little bit chilly. Let's go back. So, the sun is still out. I was all the way over there as you can see and I decided just to walk over here to my little spot again I've also noticed that the water's been up and it's going out which is good because I can sit down but not right I'd have to sit down over here <laughs> I can't sit down <coughs> anywhere else because <laughs> it's all wet so we're going to enjoy the waves we're going to enjoy the sun if only there was proper seats here it'd be easier Someone's collecting rocks. Someone's collecting rocks. Ah, oh, someone's walking their doggy as well. He, he was the guy that I walked past and just literally opened the barrier and just went in. Shouldn't have done that, but, you know, he did that. And his dog, beautiful dog, beautiful stuff. I think it's a stuff. Oh, I mean, I should know. I was thinking about Rocky at the time. <laughs> Yeah. Beautiful day. Beautiful sunniness. Thing is, you look at the sun now. If that goes behind that cloud, it's got to go all the way through it before, like before it comes back out. Because the clouds are going that way. So we enjoy what we can. Look, there's no sun where I was before. <laughs> There's no sun over there. Look. Over here. There's no sun. <laughs> Good. <Ooh. laughs> See, when the weather's like this, when it's when it's proper summertime, and I really, really want Greenwich Park to just like the top part to be completed, where you can just sit, chill. Not you don't even have to have it there, but I mean, even at the bottom of it. It's Perfect for when the sun comes out. It's bloody great, you know. Best thing about summer is when it's summer happens in England, it's the best summer you can have, you know. You know, anywhere else, just normal holiday summer thing. But here it's great. And then afterwards, when the summer's gone and it's like, nah, back to going to cold, you know, Halloween. Started to be winter. Well, technically it's autumn, but the, the spring, summer, and autumn is great. The winter just sucks. <laughs> I mean, the spring is okay, but the winter is a bit too wet. It's a bit too wet. What the hell happened there? Oh, he just dra oh, Okay, he's doing a bit of cleaning up. Okay, I get you. I get you. He's cleaning along the river, which is great. We like the cleaning. And look what I said, look, look at that cloud. We only enjoyed like five minutes of the sun over here. Because when I got here, I, I basically stood there, I took the photo. Not a fun now, guys. <laughs> um, and then, yeah, after like a minute, I thought, you know what, let's just do another video to show that I'm over here. Best thing about that sun is you look at it, there's no more clouds afterwards. I mean, it just seems like a long enough cloud, but after that, there's no more sun. But, 
as it's as the sun is behind this massive massive <laughs> grey cloud it's getting a bit nippy so I am indeed going to go back out I have been out for a while give everyone a ring so they know like, how everyone's Sunday is and that so I'm going to ring the house phone now I'm going to be like mum you made me a cup of tea I'll be down five <laughs> what ten <laughs> oh it's great when the sun's out it's a shame in, in the UK we don't get much Ooh. and little plastic things oh it's a metal thing it's like a coin I think it's a coin but they're playing music so let's go home and maybe get the sun what did I say I said as soon as I get back home the sun's going to be out so I come home I tell my mum about a cup of tea and she turns the front room into a sauna yes it was so bloody hot in there I had to open the back door then when I opened the back door the sun thought you know what I'm gonna be out here I feel like sitting there then again the more it turns I could just sit there in front of the house and just enjoy the sun could go on the roof <laughs> but that would be a bit too dangerous so I really don't know what to do I want to enjoy the sun more but we move on <sighs> guys guess what a few hours have been passed since the last clip um, that's what's happened I have basically got back into my shorts I have basically chilled in my room. I've been watching podcasts. Literally, I've only watched two podcasts and two other videos because of the podcasts are just so goddamn long. Take the piss. But we love them. We move on. We do stuff. And uh, kind of got addicted to two of my games that I've played. And like part of the time, I was just pausing one of the podcasts and just like doing the game and like unpausing. Why does a phone not just get used for a phone? You know, just messages, texts, you know, ringing people, social media to interact, that's it. There should be no games. <laughs> there should be no games, no extra little bits, no nothing like that. It's like, imagine a phone without a camera, you know, no cameras. Yeah? Just use the phone for what it is. If you want a camera, go and buy a camera. You want a video, you know? Go and buy a, a camera that can record. You know, that's 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 the way the world should be. <laughs> It'd be bloody easier for everyone. Because then I wouldn't be on my phone most of the time playing games. <laughs> but obviously, that's my fault. <laughs> but we have stopped playing the games because everything's done on the games. Um, I mean, I can do more, but it's just no point. I've got to wait for the next event on two of the games. And the others are just... There is a game that I haven't played in like two days, and I, I don't know why I haven't played it. I just can't be bothered to play it. It's like, why is it there, you know? But her, now she is a naughty girl. You know what she keeps doing? She keeps knocking stuff off. She knocked down my flipping these. She knocked these down. She knocked the flipping camera mount down. Oh, so you can be nice and comfy. Rude. Also, Went to the freezer because my mum said to my dad, oh, can you go upstairs? Can you get the fish fillets? He was like, okay, cool. He comes up here. He can't find him. He doesn't tell me this. And then I go down to, I'm literally going to the toilet and I hear him say, you're not up there. We ain't got no fish. And I'm like, my mum started to come up and I was like, mum, what do you want? And she was like, get the fish fillets out at the bottom. I went, okay. So I got them. Like, yeah, they were under the pizza boxes. Next to my uh, garlic chicken. Oh, mate. And guess what? Because of that, because I completely... Like, I didn't forget it was there. I knew I was going to have it at a later day. I thought, perfect day to have it. You know, I've, I've soaked myself in the sun today. I've chilled for a little bit. I've spoke to the family who are all good and everything sweet. I even went on the scales. I lost two pounds since the last time I went up there. Yes, it was a couple of weeks ago, but still two pounds is two pounds. I'm not going to tell you exactly how much I weigh because too embarrassed. 
even though it shouldn't be a bad, it's like it, it, it's gonna get there at some point. And then I was looking at PTs, um, like personal trainers. Obviously, that's what PT stands for, and like the cheapest gyms in the area and stuff. And like Pure Gym, the, the gym that I used to go to back in like 2016, 2015, 2014, um, that is the cheapest one. One of the cheapest ones around here. And I'm thinking, do I spend 20 quid a month on it? Well, it's, it's 22. And I'm like, I could go to the gym every day and just vlog me going to the gym. Obviously not vlog at, at the gym unless I'm like, you know, I can obviously um time lapse like me being on the treadmill me being on the bike you know i wouldn't be like videoing me doing extra stuff so i've not got a um i haven't got a tripod so i wouldn't be bringing that to the gym anyway you know I i'm thinking about all new different things because i'm like if if i went to buy a 600 pound treadmill yeah outright 600 pound it goes upstairs in the room we start using it yeah Think of the amount of money that I would have spent each month. Let's just say it's 20 quid on going to the gym where I could basically be using that treadmill for a certain amount each day, constantly a month, you know, and then like, what, six times, what, no, what am I about? Like, what, 30 months? Near enough three years to get the full like treadmill workout on like if i spent 600 quid you know um and i'm like i don't know what i should do <laughs> I'm, I'm always thinking about like better ways to better easier ways to go out you know um that's not just a treadmill obviously while i'm there i'm just using the treadmill i can use the exercise bike i can use the rowing machine Obviously, like, with one day fitness, you know, the next day, do a bit of weights on the legs or something, and then the next day, maybe the arms. And obviously, the only things that I could do, I mean, I can go out running, but I, I don't want to run outside. If I have a treadmill, I could do it inside. I do shadow boxing inside, that gets my heart rate going, perfectly fine. I use the dumbbells here, perfectly fine, but I'm, uh, I'm not sure what I should do. And that's, like, the same as swimming, do I... Do I just basically pay for better gym where I can get swimming as included as well for like an extra tenner? But the thing is, like, I'd have to, like, I mean, it's just, they're both just down the road, both of them. And I'm like, not sure what I should do. But this is a bit too long. So I'm going to go downstairs. Uh, I'm going to grab some orange juice because I've got none in the fridge. I'm going to bring them up here, watch a couple of videos. Then I'm going to set my vlog go live in the next 20 minutes, share it around, do all my business, and then I'm going to have my garlic chicken with, I'm not having, I'm not having chips, I'm not having chips for a while, I just want to have everything other than chips, you know, like burger and something, like normally it's burger and chips, yeah, so normally I'll, I'll basically have like burger and veg, I'm, I'm getting into veg, literally, I, I can eat a lot of veg, put a bit of salt on it, a bit of sauce, Depending on what sauce or even the um, the salad dressings that I have. Use that on it. And it's just better than having chips. Literally a lot better. And you, I'm getting the meat. The meat's great. And then it's just the veg. And I'm not getting any potato products. I know I've lost weight. I, I mean, apart from me obviously going on, on the scales and it says £2 less. Um, but I've, I've noticed... I've noticed my sides, <laughs> like, looking in the mirror, I was like, I was tensing my abs, and I was like, to be honest, yeah, they're out, like, you can see my abdominal muscle, like, but because of my internal visual fat behind all that, it's pumping it out more, and I don't like that, so, fitness, 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 that's, that's the main thing, <laughs> so, even though I've just walked around the house a bunch of times, let's go downstairs, not gonna lie, guys, I'm full, but I'm good. Like, I just had the dinner after, obviously, uploading the video, sharing it around. And I went down, like, I, I'm, obviously, after I shared it around, I was watching the video. Went downstairs, food is done, it's on the table. I put a bit of salt on it, put salad dressing on it, cut the chicken kievs out there. <laughs> She's going to sleep up there non-stop. 
She almost fell down the flipping back of it early on. Oh, you were saucy, didn't you? Knocking two things in front just to get a nice comfy seat on my pyjamas that I don't really use. Naughty girl. Bad. <laughs> um, but yeah. Like, oh, oh, man. Don't you just hate it when food takes so long to cook, but then it's gone within minutes. It's like, if only you could savour the, like, taste for, like, half the time it actually takes to cook. Like, you eat slow, yeah, it's all good. But if you're just eating at a normal rate, rate, it's a bit fast and then it's just gone. It's like, oh my god. That food, the garlic chicken Kiev from Tesco, their own brand, Hearty Food & Co. I'm not even, like, kidding you. I love it. Like, you get four in a box, £2.25 or something, half an hour to cook. The garlic inside, it's great. Like, I could have that every day and not get bored. Like, not even kidding you. It's just so great. But now it's gone. I mean, it's still two more because I didn't eat. And, yeah, what I had was I had that and I had half a plate of veg. <laughs> and my mum went, you sure you're going to eat all that? I went, yeah, scoffed it all, mate. <laughs> Literally, cut the garlic kiosk in half. In half again, so there was like four, and then four, and in the half of the <laughs> the plate, which is <laughs> just um, mixed veg, which was obviously broccoli, cauliflower, was it peas, peas and um, carrots, a lot of carrots. Don't get me wrong, I like carrots, but I prefer a lot of cauliflower and broccoli than carrots. Other than that, it great meal. Great meal gone. And then, pardon me, I bring my uh, spoon, or sorry, I bring a little spoon up here to go into into the freezer that's outside. Oh, hiccups now, which is annoying. And I go to my one, my ice cream, that I was like, okay, I'll have a little bit of now. First of all, the tub is broken, like it's been broke. Two, my dad has basically stole my ice cream. So I'm not happy about that. I mean, I've got another tub in there. Um, but it's like, that was my tub of ice cream. He ate his tub of ice cream. My mum's tub of ice cream, she hasn't even touched. But then he had to go and do my. Ah. So I'm not going to have no ice cream tonight. Instead, I'm going to relax. I'm going to drink some orange juice, which is right here. And I'm going to sit down, watch some videos. And then, obviously, as we end up the thing, end it with a movie on Disney+. Plus. That is the plan. Hello, guys. <laughs> you might be thinking, what the hell am I doing at this time in this room where the gym stuff is? Um, I just basically come up here to basically think about what I'm going to be doing like I, I might be moving it around I might be putting I might keep that there I might not but then I might move that turn it around that way <laughs> um but then again I'm not sure what else I'd be doing because if I turn it around that way I could have pretty much this side to basically have the deadness. Uh, or I could do deadness like that. Either way, I'm just thinking about it because I am probably focused on getting fitter. Um, even though that you know, I don't think like right now I'm going to be building any mus muscle anytime soon. Because I. No point building muscle straight away when I want to lose weight. I love that this room just smells all the time, constantly like this. And if you all know why that there is because like if I haven't explained, um, uh, this used to be my brother's room, and that is what he left there. And I was like, there, you can have it in the room. It's it's there. 
So I'm like, okay, I'm not going to take it down. Um, yeah, my sister, she pretty much has one. I don't really need a canvas for anything. So, but yeah, tomorrow, I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. I don't know. Might go see how to, might go back to the park and see how it's doing from the bottom again or from the top. Just to like constantly go there every couple of days just to see how far they've got left. And therefore I can put it on Strava to just basically walk around and walk around and obviously show you still what needs to be done, what, can, what are they doing now, all that stuff. But that is the end of the vlog. It's 8 minutes to 12 guys. Um, my dad's in bed. My mum's downstairs in the front room with the dog and the cats. Even Princess, she just left me while I had been getting stuff watched. Uh, and I know it was a guy today, because, um, well, I, I knew there was someone that commented on a, a few of my videos, and the first comment he put was like, why am I devoting like, all my time, pretty much, that I don't have, well, apart from what you see in the vlog, to like watching so much YouTube, and it's like, I watch a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I, I'm not someone that like skips over a few of their videos. It, it it depends, you know. I'm always watching everyone that I can because obviously I'm a fan of them. I want to see what they're up to. Everything, you know, the gameplays, the fitness ones, all that. So and I'm I'm I don't have that many that like do it every single day. Obviously there are a few. But there isn't that many that do it every single day. But there is still a lot of videos that come out each day. And some are a lot longer. So therefore they take a little bit more time. Um, but then yeah, the other time. The other things that I'm watching is movie and TV shows. You guys know if I'm watching a movie. Then I'll tell you what movie I'm watching beforehand probably. And then how it is afterwards. You know. So yeah, that, that's just an answer. Even though I kind of explained that to him. But yeah, I am going to go, guys. So, if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. If you haven't got an account, make an account. Click subscribe. And click the bell next to it to get notified when I do upload. Like today, I uploaded, I think it was 8 o'clock. Wait, it was at 8 o'clock. <laughs> so it was like right on time even though it's normally between 8 and 9. I feel like I should just do it for 8 o'clock now to make it easier so I don't have to wait any longer. And it's just easier for you guys to know, bang, 8 o'clock, there it is. So yeah, if you want to follow me on either Twitter, TikTok, Instagram or Strava, <coughs> then the links to them will be in the description below. I am now going to go downstairs, put this video together, which will take about half an hour. And then <clears throat> I'm going to take my tablet, drink some juice, and then go to bed. Well, I'll watch a movie and then go to bed. Something on this. Do you know what? I might even watch an episode of Doctor Who. I haven't watched Doctor Who in ages. Like the old episodes. So I'm going to do that. I hope you enjoyed today's vlog. Hopefully, everything's good with you. So, I will see you tomorrow for another vlog after 8 o'clock. Stay safe, stay humble, be kind, and I'll see you tomorrow.